Okay, ladies and gentlemen, if you're having problems with your I range X, I, R, 8, M, and it says you're missing modules of any type or you're stuck on the uh, USB connection screen or any problems like that at all, when you turn it on, here's the fix. This is the only video I've seen on how to fix this on the web. Put it in DFU mode by holding exit and then turning it on. You'll have a black screen or a clear screen, but the I range X will be on. Uh, if you've already updated before, you'll have this stuff already installed. The firmware is down in the description. You can go ahead and go down there and download it. Then uh, you unzip it to wherever you want into a folder, no matter where you want to put it. And then you go to that folder where you unzipped it and you select your DFU file as normal. Now what this is gonna do is it's gonna downgrade you. So you go ahead and click the upgrade button let it do its thing this is in fast forward of course so it <clears throat> wouldn't be sitting here all day trying to wait for it to happen because it the last part for some reason goes really 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 slow okay now once this is done you don't want to do anything with your controller okay just hit the leave uh, dfu button and then turn it off let it sit for a second hold the enter button and turn it on and you'll go into usb mode now in that same folder where you extracted everything, all of these extra files are gonna be there. Okay, I like to move the DFU file, that way I can just select everything and copy it and then paste it. Now what you wanna do here is you want to format, but uncheck quick format. Okay, hit default, then hit okay, let it do its thing. And this is a slow format. Once it's done, open it up, and then you're gonna paste all of those folders and files that you just copied into there. Now, once this is done, you do not wanna do anything except for go down to the bottom right-hand corner and eject the USB drive. Once it's ejected, you turn it off and you wait a few seconds and then turn it back on and you should be good to go. I had my throttle all the way up here, but you should be good to go. Uh, you can check it again, turn it off, turn it back on, but you always have to wait a few seconds, maybe four, five, six seconds, and then turn it back on. And booyah, there you go. You guys don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out my Patreon page. Check us out on Facebook. Later.